So anyway, if you're not showing the love of Christ, then I don't think you've ever truly been sanctified to Christ. But if you show the fruits of Christ, love, peace, and um, humbleness, I'm sure there's more, but if you bear those fruits, then you are showing that you are a true son of the King of Heaven. Now, I wanted to make this part to, like, discuss what a Christian should do. Now, I have talked about why it's important for a Christian to live a certain way, because that's the way that Jesus wants us to live, and when people see that, they think that, you know, that's what they want. I mean, maybe not all, but people see what you've got, and they want it. If you are living a life of sin and not truly changed by Jesus, then people are not going to buy that you are indeed a son of Jesus. You have to really show. Show, don't tell. There's a lot of people that say that they're Christian, but their lifestyle proves otherwise. If you are living a life of idolatry and selfishness, then that's not showing a lifestyle that Jesus wants you to live. We're called to live a lifestyle of holiness. And who is Jesus? God. Jesus is God. And so he requires us to live like him, to be the image of him. That's why it's important for us to live this way. So that we can show who we are from. We can't be living like the devil and expecting people to be saved by Jesus, who is the opposite of the enemy. So I would recommend you give yourself unto Jesus Christ. Ask Him to cleanse you. If you sinned and you're living a lifestyle that Jesus doesn't want you to live, repent of it now so that you can be the image of Jesus' perfect love. Because there is a day coming when you will stand before Jesus and He'll ask you, what did you do with the time that I gave you? It's time for us to take our walk with Jesus seriously and stop living as though we are still of this world. It's time to start living like we are of heaven, because that's what we are when we come to Jesus, truly. We're supposed to be ambassadors of Christ, not sinners of the world. I want you to think about that. It's time to want this. It's time to want to be like Jesus. Because if you don't want it, you're not going to do it. You need to ask Jesus for that desire to serve and to be the image of Jesus. That's how you're going to win souls. That's how you're going to get a reward. That's how you're going to make an impact in somebody's life and in this world. Thank you guys for watching. By the way, uh, next part I'm going to be talking about how you need to be prepared to fight. Because the enemy will send things your way to distract you or to try to put a stop to you completely. Now I'm going to show you how you fight. See you guys later.